So to fix this issue, let's move to the first method. Just press Windows and R key together from your keyboard. And now type inetcpl.cpl and now click on OK. Now when you reach here, click on Connection. Now click on LAN Settings. And now uncheck this, automatically detect settings. Uncheck this and now click on OK. And your problem will be fixed. If this does not fix your problem, let's move to the next method. Just search CMD. Right click on the command prompt icon, click on run as administrator. Once this command prompt window open up, you have to run these commands one by one. Okay. Just copy and paste and run these commands one by one. All these four commands and the description of the video given below, you can directly copy it from the description video. Description of the video. Now, if this also does not fix your problem. There is one more thing which you can do and that is press Windows and R key together again and type ncpa.cpl. Now click on OK. And now just right click on that wireless adapter uh, adapter with which you are connected to the internet. In my case, I am connected by Ethernet. So I'll right click here. If you are connected by Wi-Fi, right click there. So click on properties and now select Internet Protocol version 4. TCP IPv4, click on properties again and now check use the following DNS server address and now we will use Google DNS. Okay. 8888 and 8844. Okay. And now click on OK. After that, try again and your problem will be fixed. If now if this also does not work, there is one more thing which you can do, and that is just turn off your router for 30 seconds. Okay. Just turn it off. And after 30 seconds, just turn it on again. In this way, it gets reset and your problem may be solved. That's it, guys. Please do like the video to support us.